Now, they stopped short of stretching this out to the prison system because officials say it would cost them billions more. Jamie, should the prisoners be kept cool in the summer? Is that just common sense? No. Who should be kept cool are these hardworking, law-abiding, tax-paying uh, workers who a lot of them living, living paycheck to paycheck. They should be working in a safe environment with cool air in this heat of summer, not prisoners who go to prison because they committed a crime. That's ridiculous. Doug, what do you think? Wow. Uh, I think it's common sense. Uh, th th this is a law to protect workers. So if you're in a workplace and it gets more than 88 degrees, they got to cool it down. That makes sense. Now, for the prisons, I'm sorry. We don't have another couple billion dollars to do this with. We, we just don't. We have to prioritize what it is we want to spend our money on. All right. Well, a big cost for the prisons, yeah, but studies do show the rule could cut indoor workplace heat injuries down drastically and ultimately save money in the prisons, Doug. You know, I haven't seen anything that tells me how many work or heat injury or heat illness things are happening in the prisons uh, and any cost study. Right now, I'm just railing about the fact that, come on, $2 billion? Find it. We don't have it. Jamie. I agree 100%. It, t it costs well, over $100,000 to keep a prisoner in prison, and now you want to spend more money to bring... Co come on, people. Well, I think the bottom line is this, though. Take the prisons out of it. It's really important for a place like the desert. And, uh, you know, if you live here in the summer, you know how hot it is. So can we all agree it's a very good thing for the people that work here? Oh, yes. Yep. All yes. right. Okay.